Liquor laws are strictly enforced in the Western Cape, especially on the beaches in and around Cape Town. Introducing, possessing and consuming alcohol here is prohibited. The nearly 20,000 bottles confiscated this festive season is similar to the amount seized last year. We confiscate alcohol whether it's opened or closed the moment it's in your possession or you find consuming it, we confiscate it. We want people to come and enjoy themselves and not to create problems. And alcohol is a very, very major part of our strategy to make sure our beaches are safe and that families can come to the beach and enjoy themselves. Most of the liquor seized from the public are beers and ciders. There's also plenty of the stronger stuff, as well as wine disguised as juice. And one person had 12 bottles of expensive Cape wine confiscated. People do lots of different things um, to disguise it. They put it in their baby's clothing, they put it in the wife's bag, they bury it in the sand early in the morning, they come and collect it later on. So, yeah, people are ingenious when it comes to getting alcohol onto the beaches. Offenders are issued with a fine of 500 rands, or they have to appear in court. And they have to pay an additional 560 rands if they want their alcohol released and returned to them. If the offenders do not claim their bottles or cans of alcohol within three months, they are emptied into these huge tanks behind me. The tanks of alcohol are then handed to the police and disposed of as toxic waste. Cape Town authorities say they are confident that confiscating the illegal alcohol helps prevent dangerous incidents and behaviour on the city's beaches. Alcohol safety is a big issue on our beaches. We confiscate alcohol, you're not allowed to bring onto the beaches at all. One of the main reasons is we want to prevent drownings on our beaches and bad behaviour. We've only had seven drownings so far this year, whereas we've had 14 at the same corresponding period last year. We think a large role is played because of the amount of alcohol that we confiscate. It's very really sad that people still bring alcohol to the beaches. I can't see why people can't enjoy them without alcohol. Uh, we do take more and more away every year, but I would like people to stop bringing alcohol to the beaches to say, listen, let's just have a good time without alcohol. Law enforcement officers say they are getting better and better at detecting illegal alcohol on the beaches and will continue being tough on those who continue to break the law. Rene Dalcom, CGTN, Cape Town, South Africa.